U.S. President Donald Trump has signed a legislation aimed at protecting the rights of the Hong Kong people. It's a strong move and one that's been welcomed by many people in Hong Kong and in other democracies. However, and not that surprisingly, China is not happy about that. For more on this and other news around the world, let's go over to our Kim Dami at the News Center. Tell me first, um, how is the Hong Kong government responding to this? The Beijing-backed Hong Kong government was quick to express regret, criticizing Washington for interfering in Hong Kong affairs. A government spokesperson said Thursday that the Hong Kong Human Rights and Pro-Democracy Act is a two-sided law that seems to support human rights and democracy, but in fact forcefully controls Hong Kong, just like UN sanctions. It also pointed out that Washington's unilateral decision will have a negative impact on economic benefits and the relationship between the U.S. and Hong Kong. Warning that Trump's decision won't help resolve the chaos in Hong Kong, the spokesperson urged the U.S. to take appropriate actions so it can remain a preferred trading partner of Hong Kong. In addition, China also warned it can deploy military personnel stationed in Hong Kong to calm the chaos if it so chooses. On the other hand, Thursday was a day of celebration for people in Hong Kong. Hundreds of thousands of people took to the streets in Central District, this time to celebrate and thank the U.S. president. Calling the new law Trump's Thanksgiving present, protesters waved American flags and revealed their plan to hold another big rally on December 8th. Despite strong objections from Beijing, President Trump signed the Hong Kong Human Rights and Democracy Act on Wednesday which ensures the civil rights of Hong Kong people and could threaten attempts to end the U.S.-China trade war.